Sunt and unarmed civilians continue to face brunt of Pakistan shelling along the line of control as well as the international border. Today morning, once again, Pakistani rangers train barrels of their guns towards the civilian areas here in Ramgarh sector. Many of the villages came under intense shelling from Pakistan's side. One 19-year-old girl was killed when the splinter hit her on the head. And one more person has sustained the splinter injury here in Ramgarh sector and he is undergoing treatment in hospital. How many hours have you been shelling here? What are you doing? Rally Pandya, yes, I don't know. I don't know. What did you do? Rally Pandya, I was in the house. Rally Pandya, I was in the house. He was taking care of the cattle and the livestock when one of the killer's shell from a cross exploded nearby his house and splinter hit his abdomen. And it was immediately evacuated to the hospital. Had he not been timely evacuated, it would have led to the fatal casualty. We have seen that during the last few days, more than 45 persons have sustained splinter injuries. And Pakistan is continuously targeting civilian areas. Say more than 60 villages so far have been targeted by Pakistan during the last 10 days. Failing to match military might of Indian troops and firepower of BSF, Pakistan Army and Pakistani Rangers have repeatedly and frequently started targeting civilian areas. Today morning at about 6.30 a.m., once again they violated ceasefire, targeting several border outposts and villages in Ramgarh sector. One of the shells exploded in nearby Jeda village, killing 19-year-old girl. You can see many a terrified villagers, they have taken shelter inside this concrete bunker so that they can flee from the killer shells fired from across the border. Can you tell us what happened in the morning and how many shelling started? In the morning, the shelling started. We all were in our homes. We were giving them four bombs. There were four bombs in our homes. One bomb that came to Jorabar Singh's house. She was about 19 years old. She was making food in the morning. One bomb came to the house. She was making food in the morning. She was making food in the morning. She was making food in the morning. उद खत्म हो गया गांव में सब आपरा तफरी पार की छह सात बम और गिरे हैं गांव में अभी हम लोग गांव छोड़के थोड़ा पीछे आ गए हैं और कुछ आदमी घरों में हैं और औरतों को पीछे कर लिया है Many villagers are forced to flee from their homes because of the intense shelling from Pakistan's side. Yesterday there was 